It's been a long while since we played this game, and uh, that's because we were finishing this when my mic broke. Real OG fans will remember. And then I got this computer that we're playing on now, and the save did not transfer. But I finally figured out, thanks to one of my mods, how to get the save here. So now we can finish what we started. And we don't have that many achievements left. We've got the art classes, which I wanted to do anyway. That was the biggest uh, motivation for frying this thing up again, was finishing the art classes. And then there are some other things we're missing, like decor and litter. I forget the other things, but we'll check in. I don't want to look anything up for this game as, for as long as possible. Because we've done everything without um, any hints from the outside world. Let's see if we can finish it that way. Uh, Alright, let's start off with some art classes since we're already here. I don't know how many we have left to do. I'm going to try not to spend too much time on them, but you know me. Oh, I'm not even reading. Uh, I want you to express anger. Oh no, one of these. I know it might be difficult for some of you. This sounds like a lot of my homework at university, to be honest. We get the most depressing prompts. But we all feel negative emotions like anger. And art can be a safe and healthy way to express those. So, express yourself. Channel your deepest inner anger and put that on the canvas. Bruh. Um, okay, I wasn't prepared for this. Uh, let's just draw something with fire, I suppose. Do we have enough colors for that? I think so. Um, hmm. I don't really remember how to use all the controls, like how to make our brush bigger. Um, hmm. Oh, that's definitely not it. That was I. B for brush? V? Nope. Bruh. Okay, that's really weird. Uh, no. Oh, okay. There are number keys. Wait a minute. Maybe not. Ah! I've never done that before. Okay. This is embarrassing. I swear I've tried like every single letter. Um... Oh, here we go. This will be helpful. Brush size, Alt or X. I swear I clicked X. Brush color is Z. Okay, X and Z. All right. X. Oh, there we go. So X is size. Z is color. Why does that? It worked once. Oh, it only works when I'm on the canvas. Okay, I didn't know that was a rule. Sure, I guess. Okay, uh, we're back in business. Let's make some fire. As I, I don't know what to do for this prompt otherwise. I came on here to, to forget my anger. <laughs> and the game is telling me to relive it. I forgot we could erase with the left mouse. Okay, this is starting to look like a really bad drawing of Bowser from Mario. <gasps> is the background green? I wanted it to be yellow, but I think I've chosen green. Is this yellow? Actually, we have our own special colors. Um, 
that yellow? Please? I hope? Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't want to do that. Undo. Oh. I know I said I wasn't going to take very long on this, but this is... This is just me trying to get used to controls again. I swear it'll go faster. Did I do green again? Do we not have yellow? Huh. Maybe I, I just don't have yellow. Is this yellow? I can't tell. Someone can let me know if that's yellow or not. I think it might just be green again. Hmm. Maybe I should have stuck with white. I'll go with this one. I don't think this is yellow, but... Or maybe pink? Yeah, pink is nice. Okay, we'll do pink. was this color. Actually, I want my pink back. How did I forget so badly? Okay, here we go. Let's use another custom color. This one should do. all of these for the first time I was using my laptop's trackpad but now I'm using a really bad mouse so if these look worse than my old ones we're gonna blame it on that okay do I have another shade of red in here pink another pink nope okay I'll just use the red again I suppose Leave it like that, actually. I kind of like that. Does that look like fire, though? <laughs> we outline this. Ah! I keep erasing on accident. put orange in the middle and now I'm worried that's not orange but I really can't tell <laughs> is this orange I just don't know put that there okay <laughs> what other color were we using this um, let's do a final outline I hate this mouse. I've been wanting to get a new one for a while. <laughs> this game is might be the the catalyst that finally gets me to get a new one. All right, we've got some nasty little spots here. 
Uh, but other than that, I, I'd call this okay. It's, it's fire. It's what we were going for. Alright, brushes down. Let's see how they look. Oh yeah, I forgot we do critiques in this class. Woof. Whoa. Yeah. This one was easier for me than I thought. Turns out I had a lot to express. It looks like eggs did too. Leo, welcome in! I love the emote. <laughs> how are you doing? Uh, I don't think you've seen us play this game, have you? Is Chicory a new game for you? Are you familiar with it? It's balanced in terms of light and space. You made a specially tasteful use of that orange-yellow color. Oh, thank god we've got orange in there. I thought we might have just used green in the center. Uh, this image feels all about that red color. Oh, okay, we did use the right colors. Hooray! <laughs> it's new? Ooh, yay. Well, we're at the end of it, so... I mean, hopefully this isn't, like, spoiling anything, but... I think this is a game where you don't really have to worry about spoilers. I'm doing good. That's good to hear. How about you? I'm doing good. I'm pretty tired, but like, not physically tired, more like my brain is fried, so I thought this would be a good game to come back to because it's just like, art. I struggled a lot in this one. The ang- er, uh, the anger. The prompt for this drawing, by the way, was anger, so I drew fire because I didn't know what else to do. And I struggled a lot not making it green. I guess I'm not as in touch with my feelings. Nice job, Eggs. Oh, our name is Eggs in this game, by the way. Okay. That's all for now. Your piece will be at the Desert Mountain Eggs. Keep practicing. Nice. Okay. Uh, I don't know how many of these we have left, but we're gonna 100% this. Wanna take a class with us? Yes. Take your places, everyone. All right. All right. Take a look at this old classic. Oh, that's very nice. I'm not gonna be able to make something like that. <laughs> not with this mouse. A breezy field by vanilla. Do your best to try and recreate it. Okay. <laughs> Certainly gonna try. What colors do we want to use? Seems like a nice one. Background, maybe? Actually, that's pretty dark. Um, let's go with this one. Let's do the character for last and start with the background. I think that's something Bob Ross would approve of. Alright, let's try the mountain first. Oops, that was not straight. Okay. Get some white in here. Get some shading going on. Good enough. Um, we got a weird field of something. This color? Yeah? I'll go with that for now.
of shading. It's not super detailed, but uh, it's the best I can do with this mouse. Uh, Leo, have you had any time to play any more Omori? Any other video games? In the past, what is it, like, less than 24 hours since I've last spoken to you? <laughs> okay, let's do the fox lady now. Playing it right now? Ooh, but I have a doubt now. A doubt? Uh oh, about what? I just defeated Humphrey and there were two keys outside. Ooh, T and W, right? holes. This is so suspenseful. <laughs> uh, I went into one of the holes and then the other one wasn't there. Was I supposed to pick the key, enter the hole, and then pick the other one. Oh my gosh, Leo, I did the exact same thing. <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to get one and then get the other one. <laughs> uh, but they're both really short. I mean, obviously, I think you're gonna maybe load back a save file and go see it for yourself, but you could always look it up. Yeah, Tinder reload, <laughs> I figured. <laughs> That's- that's what I would have done. I did the exact same thing. I- I grabbed them both and I- I thought they would stay there. But yeah, they disappear. Kinda jank, but... What are you gonna do? <laughs> I should have warned you! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so funny. I think I'll have to defeat both bosses again. Oh no, then Leo, don't do it. <laughs> don't reload. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't do it. Just look it up. I've done it. Go watch my VOD or something. <laughs> I'll send you a clip or something. Don't do it. <laughs> it's not worth it. The one that I... Well, actually, which one did you get? Is that the one where there's the VHS tapes? They're both really short, like, I think if you do that, you're gonna be really underwhelmed. That's not the one with the VHS tapes? Okay. I remember one of those, like, what one of the scenes looked like. Don't reload. <laughs> Holes are not by location. Oh. Oh. By progression? Oh. Hi, how are you? Good to see ya. I'm good. Um, having fun with some chicory. Nothing but good vibes. Uh, depends on the number you've done what you get, I think. Oh, really? I thought they were all the same, but I just assumed that. I haven't looked into it. So you're probably right.
I saw one with someone trying to chop down a tree. Oh, okay. I think, I think, okay. I, I have seen that one. I think I know what the other one is. And I don't think you're missing anything like crazy. Doing good, yay. Milo and Beans and I are streaming right now. Oh my gosh, I just wanted to pop in. Well, thank you for popping in. I didn't even notice. I would have come and watched you guys. Have fun playing what you're playing. What's this game? Uh, this is Chicory, A Colorful Tale. It's a lot of fun. Uh, we played most of it like many months ago and I just finally uh, saved, or I guess not saved, recovered my save file. Um, so I wanted to finally finish it, but I really recommend it. There's a lot of like art involved. It's a very good time, very good vibes. I think this game just won some kind of indie game award too, which is very well deserved. Um, you can also play this game co-op. I don't know about with three people, but like if Milo and Beans wanted to play this with you, um, there is a co-op version that I did with one of my mods, but I never tried to do it with three people, so. You never know. What game are you guys playing? Uh, we were just on Minecraft on Hypixel. Ooh, I don't know what Hypixel is, but Minecraft is always a good time. Don't like that. Uh, sometimes you just want to give a little detail in here and you can't. Nuts. Oh well, I guess that'll do. Um, Hypixels is just a public server with different games you can play together. Ooh, okay. I'll decide later if I reload the game or not. <laughs> Leo, I don't think you should, because I think I think I know what that that hole is. I think you'll be really upset if you reload. <laughs> I like the small nose better. Okay. Oh, don't like that eye. The little eye is kind of creeping me out. Let's get rid of that. Maybe change it? Oh, actually. Not so bad in another color. Okay, maybe we keep it. Uh... What is it? Do you want me to spoil it for you? <laughs> I'll say it, but... I gotta get permission first. This game looks so calming. It really is. I really recommend it. It does get a little stressful, but there are a lot of, like, content warnings in it, so, like, it never catches you off guard. And, um, you know, those moments do not last a while. I think they do a really good job at using it for storytelling. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> So if you go to the hole and you click on it, you don't jump down the hole. Um, something just comes out of the hole and then disappears. Like that's that's literally it. That's why I think you'd be mad if you reloaded. It's just like it's a super short scene. What something? Something the the name of the the thing with the eye. The one-eyed ghost? Yeah. <laughs> one-eyed ghost. I like that. <laughs> that is what it is. I used to call it like a fire demon. I thought it was shaped like fire. Oh my gosh, I forgot to give her her little hat. Okay, we gotta get that color back. What color did I use? Hmm. 
Okay. Oops, okay, we're gonna have to give her her hand back, that's fine. Um, seems like a very chill game. It really is. I definitely recommend this one as well. Um, but mostly if you like doing art. The boss battles in this I found to be a little difficult, but they were more fun and easier on um, co-op. Even though you can skip the bosses, like you can turn that off. But I chose not to because I wanted to see it in its entirety. Even being this chill, it reminds me of Scribblenauts. Oh my gosh, Scribblenauts! Bruh, that was the vibe! I loved Scribblenauts. I haven't thought of that game in forever. That was like the definition of calm. I will leave now, but if you're streaming later, I will definitely tune in. Thank you, Rook. Um, if I end before you guys, I'll try and come in and, and see ya. I see you on my, my side now. So I'll try to pop in. Bye, thank you for coming in. Have a fun time playing Minecraft. Say hi to everybody for me. Leo, did that help you determine whether or not you're gonna go reload? <laughs> ooh, that, ooh, that didn't look like the bow I wanted it to. Okay, that kind of looks like a bow. I'm trying to Google it. <laughs> Let me know if you need help finding it. I'm back for like a split second. Milo and Bean say hi back. Oh, thank you for coming back to say that. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Bye, Rook. Have fun. So sweet. That doesn't... Mm. Okay, that's a good enough hand. Uh, now we just need her little legs, and then I think we're good to go. What will I to do for her little legs? Maybe just this? Yeah, those look weird, but... I think that's fine. <laughs> I think that's good enough. <laughs> Alright, brushes down. Let's see how we did. Uh, the original was definitely better. <laughs> hmm. It feels mysterious, just like the original. I wonder what the artist was thinking about. I like the emphasis on light yellow. Bruh, I don't even know where light yellow is being used. I'm intrigued by the splash of dark purple, dark blue violet. Oh, I think that's the shoe color. Uh, it's full of varied colors. Ooh. This was a tough one for me, but you did great, Eggs. Nice, okay. That's it for now. Uh, your pieces will be in the Elevens' Master Gallery Eggs. Keep practicing. Very nice. All right. Uh, Let's keep doing this. Take your places, all right. I don't know how many more of these we have, surely not that many. For today's assignment, I want you to create a cool or scary creature. Oh, I know what I'm doing. We've done a cute creature before, but I wanna see you express something more intense. Think about where your creature might live or what sorts of things it eats. That might give you a clue to figure out its form. Actually, for the cute prompt, uh, we did something I'll keep secret for now, but that you might recognize, Leo, because it was a reference to Omori. And I think I'm gonna make this one something from Omori. Uh, literally something as well. 
I can make the right shape. Oh my gosh, I hate this mouse. Okay, that's a good base. What direction does the eye go? Beans, hi! Welcome in. Drawing with a mouse, damning. <laughs> this mouse is awful. How are you? I hear you're playing Minecraft with Mel and Rook. How is that going? Uh, I need to check the eye orientation. Have you played this game before, Beans? Or know about it? No and no lol. <laughs> uh, I think it just- it's starting to get popular. I hope it gets even more popular. It's a really fun game. I very highly recommend it. Uh, and I was just telling Rook there's a co-op mode, which I played with my mod for a bit, which is a lot of fun. Uh, but if you like drawing, which I know you do, shout out to everyone watching, I think I've mentioned before, Beans has drawn me some lovely fan art that I have printed out and put on my little desk area. I have that in my Instagram story highlights, so please check it out. <laughs> you printed it? I printed a tiny version of it. <laughs> it's just above my desk. It brings me so much joy. <laughs> I have that and a little thing that has a bunch of pictures of Nanami from Jujutsu Kaisen and it says do it for him. I'm gonna cry. Oh my gosh, beans. <laughs> I almost cried when I saw that fan art. It was so cute and so sweet. Nanami shine. Oh my gosh, yes. I have seen some very dedicated Nanami shrines. I I can't compete with those. But I have this this tiny one. It's literally just the smallest printed picture of him, but it's enough. People go hard on shrines. I know, especially when a a character's birthday comes around. They'll do like multiple ones. It gets intense. I don't think I have like the space for something like that, <laughs> but you never know, maybe in the future. Uh, did you enter the black space during the normal route? Yes, yes I did. It's cool that you printed it. I'm smiling so much right now. Oh my gosh, well it's so cool that you drew it. What? It was the sweetest thing I've ever seen. Should we give this a background? Hmm. I don't know if I like it with or without a background. Black space... Two, right? Two? Like night two? I don't know. It's been a while. <laughs> I know that we went to black space for sure. In the normal Omori true route. Ooh, maybe we do red? Ooh, scary. Yeah, let's do red. That looks unsettling. Oh, maybe blue? Or do we have a fun color? No, all of mine are pastel. To so nobody's surprise. Uh, I kind of like the red. I don't know, that's what it's called where I'm reading it. Oh. I can- here, let me look that up just to make sure then. What did you say? Black Space 2? Black Space 2... Omori. 
Even when we're not playing Omori, we're always talking about Omori. <laughs> Very fitting for Lore the Red. I think so too. Okay, let's turn that in. I'm glad you guys like it too. What side are you on, Leo? Oh, are you doing Neo Seeker again? Oh, there's a YouTube video actually. Black Space 2? I think Black Space 2, if you're watching this YouTube video, I think this is what you get when you do Black Space and Hikikomori. I don't think that's the right one. Don't look at that. Don't get spoiled. All right, brushes down. Uh, let's see how they look. Let's see how our class likes our trauma demon. Aw, cool. Cool. Grr. I wouldn't want to meet this one. <laughs> it's right to the point. Okay, nice. I can really feel the focus on dark red. Ooh, our teacher liked the red too. Uh, there's an even chiaroscuro here. Okay. I haven't heard that word since art class and I don't really know what it means. It's super, super cool. It reminds me of this movie I really love. Oh my God, if he had said a video game, I would have screamed. Maybe it has a kind heart though. Bruh, now I'm screaming. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> this is getting too real. <laughs> That's what I like to think. Okay. Bruh. <laughs> that was kind of scary. Uh, that's all for now. Your piece will be at the Simmer Springs Resort Inks. Keep practicing. That comet kind of killed me. Uh, alright. Let's see what our next prompt is. Take a look at this old classic. Ooh, it's a restoration. <laughs> look at that, what the heck? <laughs> this is, this is a funny one. The Bachelor Party by Plantain. Okay. That title is quite fitting, I love it. Kitty, isn't it cute? <laughs> Actually, that reminds me, Leo, how's Tally doing? Uh, let's see how you bring it to life. Yes, let's. Oh no, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Uh, okay, let's start with the background. Actually, maybe this color? Yeah, let's do that. Alright, then we got a white table. Ooh, ooh, clean. Oh, oh, I spoke too soon. Uh, oh well, that'll do. Uh, got, like, wine on the table. Maybe I should do the kitties first. Let's do the kitties first. Need this color for the one on the Right. Oh, and I've goofed off of it. Maybe this color? No, I like the other one. This one's given quite the judgmental stare. I'm kind of here for it. Oh, there I go again. By me, I mean this god awful mouse. Some very chubby cheeks. Let's do for the eyes, actually. She's doing great, though she's being lazy. Oh, <laughs> she deserves to be lazy. I'm glad she's doing good. This might be good for the eyes. I quite like that, actually. Oh my god, he's wearing like- they're both wearing monocles? 
Am I gonna be able to do that? Uh, okay, let's try. Does that even look like a monocle? This looks scary. Maybe a different color. looks really bad. <laughs> Maybe we leave the monocles off in this version. <laughs> See this for the nose? Okay, yeah, let's do that. Um, got a little collar, too. I was gonna say she, but it's a bachelor party, so they're bo probably both little dudes, little fellas. Let's give him a collar. They are de fancy <laughs> We might make them a little fancier towards the end. I guess we don't want him to look too de-fancied. He's got a fancy little collar still, though. And they're gonna get their, their wine bottle. Although, I don't know if I can do the, like, martini glass. Is this timed? No, it's not. You can take all the time you want, which is really nice. I mean, not great for me, because I, I do take a lot of time sometimes <laughs> when there's no pressure, but also very nice that there's no pressure. Because you can make all the mistakes you want, and fix it. I think I've started making one thing and then I start over completely. Very calm. Okay, I don't know how we're gonna do this other one. He's got quite the manic energy going on. Can we capture that? I just don't know. I don't know what color to do either. Hmm. Do we have a good one? Orange? Yeah, let's go with orange. I couldn't find the holes thing in video. Oh, okay, let me... Hmm. I can find it for you because I know where it would be in my... My streams and I think we I have it saved like as a highlight let me find it I'm pretty sure I saved it okay it would have been hikikomori have to browse a lot for it. No, I think I can find it easily. I'm quite organized. Let me make sure, though. I just need to find when I beat Humphrey. I can't remember. I think I found it. Okay. Okay, I found it. It's in one hour fifty-nine of my one of my highlights. I don't know how to like express that. Like which highlight it is. I can send you like a whisper or something. You're gonna get a raid? What the heck? You guys? <laughs> Oh my gosh, thank you, Mel. <laughs> Welcome in. Are you guys done playing?
You can link it in your chat? Okay, I'll try to do that. Although I have links uh, turned off still, so hopefully I don't goof that up. Hello, you guys! I'm immune to bots? Ooh, okay. How was Minecraft? What is that emote? Oh my gosh. Mel, that's so cute. <laughs> is that a Roblox character? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's my old Roblox character? Oh my gosh, that's a really creative emote. Welcome in, Ranmaru Sad. Lillian, welcome in. Hi, everyone. Thanks for raiding, Mel. <laughs> I hope you guys had a good time. We're doing a very chill chicory art stream. What you up to? Uh, right now we're doing art classes in this game. Uh, right now we're trying to redraw this with my mouse. Oh my gosh, thank you, Mel. Hi. You come here often? Love and appreciate that. Thank you, Lillian, for following. Welcome in. Anyone familiar with chicory? Uh, I would warn about spoilers, but I don't think this game where we are has too many. Thank you, Ranmaru Sad, for following. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much, Mel. And Beans. Oh my god. You guys. You guys are so sweet to me. Makes me want to cry. Tears of happiness. Leo, I'm gonna get you that link. Let me figure out how to do this. Okay. Ooh, I found it. Oh, and I clicked out of it somehow. Okay, I got it again. Why is it not letting me copy it? Copy it. Okay. This is for Leo. <laughs> Anyone else can watch it too. <laughs> um... But it's an hour and 39 in, or 59 or something. I already lost the thing. Let me try and find it again for you. Oh, hour 59. 159. That'll get you to see the two keys. Oh my gosh, thank you, Rook! That is the sweetest Christmas gift. Actually, speaking of Christmas gifts, closer to Christmas, we're gonna do more um, art request streams. Hopefully I can get all of you guys an art request. I've done one for Beans, but I owe Beans quite a few now that Beans has drawn me lovely fan art. That will be my Christmas gifting to all of you. <laughs> Thank you very much, Eve. You are the best. Leo, you're too nice. No, it's fine. Beans, I insist. It's only if you want it, though. If there's ever a character you want me to draw, you let me know. That goes for all of y'all. What did we use for the background color? This? Nope. Oh, another fun fact, I'm colorblind, so we spend quite a bit of time trying to find the colors I've just used. Oh, there we go. Oh, thank God. Merry Christmas, thank you. <laughs> Anyone got any fun holiday plans? I've been asking that for a while. Seems like everyone's having a chill Christmas. I'm definitely having a chill Christmas. I'm gonna try and get you to affiliate. Mel, you've already gotten me so far. I appreciate everything. You've put in work. I feel like I've gotta pay you for like being my manager or something. <laughs> trip? Ooh, y'all are going on a trip? My dad and I are gonna watch a hockey game for Christmas. Oh, an in-person hockey game. Very fun. Do not pay me. Oh, we'll see. If we get to affiliate and we're making cash, we'll see. <laughs> At the very least, uh, y'all are getting art. You're getting paid in art. Where'd my orange color go? And the art will not look like this. It will not be done with my horrible mouse. Let's finish up these kitties. You get a different one with the first one, so I guess it's still not the same I would have gotten. Really? It's different? 
Aw, oh, nuts. Oh, wait, maybe it's because... Mm, actually, I don't know. I was gonna say, maybe it's because Hikikomori. Hmm, let me take a look. That's really weird. Hmm. That's really weird. Okay, I can try and find the time I did it on... Um, what is it called? The the True Route Leo. Because I have all those videos. I don't have them highlighted, but I have them on um, like my hard drive. Evie, I want to make you some fan art real bad. Give me a couple days. My hands are dying. Rook, that's so nice. <laughs> Take all the time you need. That's so sweet. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love fan art. I was just telling Beans. I've, I've got their fan art printed up on my, on my wall. It's so nice. I'm also colorblind. Oh my gosh, Lillian, colorblind gang. Love to hear it. Do you also do art? Uh, I will send it to you on IG. Oh my gosh, thank you, Rook. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'll redo the damn bosses <laughs> and let you know. <laughs> okay, Leo. <laughs> it's okay, you focus on your stream. Okay, well, I'll, I'll find it off stream sometime, okay? I think I can find it. I'll try to remember. If I remember... I'll send it to you. If I don't remember, then we'll let it go, but... If you're gonna redo the bosses, I guess you won't need it. Ugh, I was hoping we could avoid that for you, though. That's gonna suck. At least you're a pro gamer, though. It'll probably go by fast for you. Uh, Lillian, sometimes. Ooh, do you have favorite things to draw? Or do you do digital art? Versus traditional? Or perhaps just painting? You know, I haven't painted in a long while. Uh, but since winter break's coming up and I'll finally have time off of school, I really want to get back into it. Okay, this little fella is doing something a little funny. He's got a little arm here. This little paw. Ooh, he's looking... <laughs> I'm, I'm making him look a little weird. Uh, he's got another paw here. That one's a little chonkier than I wanted it to be. Nothing wrong with a chonky paw, of course. That's maybe good enough. Is this the art background color? Yes. Okay. Um. It looks cute. Thank you. I love cats. We love cats in this chat. Do you have any cats or any pets, Lillian? Or anyone else? I know Leo has a cat. A little kitty. Uh, that reminded me of the chunkiest paws I've seen. <laughs> They're not tallies, are they? I added this new channel point thing called Eat Hot Chip, so me and the admin beans are gonna go buy like one chip challenge. Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> Wait. I I have a friend who did that. <laughs> Are you guys going to be okay? <laughs> That's a channel point thing. How many channel points does it got cost? I'm going to have to start saving up to see that. <laughs> uh cat and two dogs. Oh my gosh, that's the dream. I've only got one doggy, but I really want to get some more pets in here. Not tallies. <laughs> okay, I figured maybe not. A picture I found randomly on the internet? I'll whisper it to you. Ooh, okay, thank you, Leo. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. It's only me eating it. Oh no, Mel, you're doing it alone? You're gonna need some moral support. I am a little white boy, so I will die. <laughs> I would die too. <laughs> I think most people would, <laughs> to be fair. Oh my gosh. Are you doing like face cam while you do it? I watched uh, a VOD back. I don't think you do face cam, do you? That might be for the best if there's no face cam. <laughs> I would probably be crying and like screaming, crying, throwing up that entire meme set. What did we use for the eye color? I think it was this. This little dude's eyes look Absolutely deranged. 
Hmm. I'm not doing it. I'm just buying it for him. Oh. Not yet. I want to do a PNG tuber one day though. Oh my gosh. Yay. PNG tubers rise. Try whispering something to me to see if I can send it that way. Ooh, okay. If you need any help setting that up, Mel, uh, please let me know. Because I know it takes like a weird bit of code to get the character to talk through Discord when you're not talking. So if you need any help setting that up, I found a YouTube video that helps, but I think I figured out how to do it a little bit on my own. My mod certainly helped me. Okay, let's see if I can figure out how to use whispers. This will be interesting. Ooh. Okay. I think I got it, Leo. You're gonna make me sob? No, Mel. It's the least I can do. Oh my gosh, you've been so nice. It's 1 a.m. for me over here. Lillian, go to bed. <laughs> I second that. I know Leo's staying up too. Uh, I appreciate you staying up with us, Lillian, but if you gotta go to bed, I love and respect that. You are so kind to me. You guys are so kind to me. Oh my gosh, more cute emotes. The panty you're doing reminds me of this one thing I've seen. It's really, really cute. Ooh, like another video game? I really don't wanna. <laughs> well, Lillian, then I, I love and respect that option as well. <laughs> I tried to go to bed, not early, early yesterday, but somewhat good time. And I was just lying in bed for like two hours. Sometimes it just doesn't happen. Hey, how are we gonna do his manic little eye? Oh, there we go. Nice. I think we got it. Let's give him... A little nose. Then we gotta give him his little mouth. I don't know what to do for that color. Maybe this? That looks ridiculous. Ah! No! There we go. Salvaged. Okay. That's... <laughs> that's kind of... Right? A man screaming? He really is. <laughs> Uh, I believe this piece was titled by the game, uh, to be Bachelor Party, by the way. Quite fitting. Ooh, I just realized he doesn't have a collar. Let's give this dude his little frowny face of disapproval. This is so hard, I have to do like one click at a time. Okay, I can live with that. Uh... VO Dude Tube Mini is a little app you can use for PNGs, I think. I don't stream myself, so I'm not entirely sure. I don't think I've heard of that, but I'll check it out. Um, wait, that's adorable. Aw, oh, thank you, Rook. Do you like math or reading more? Reading, a thousand percent. <laughs> I'm in university and haven't been in a math class for like four years, and I don't miss it. What about you guys, though? <laughs> what end of the spectrum are you on? And when it comes to reading, I should add the disclaimer that I love reading, but I usually read manga most of the time. Look at the picture I whispered to you, Eve. I want to hear you awing. Oh, okay. Hate math? Yes, Lillian. Solidarity. <laughs> I know Leo's a coder, though. No shade. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Those are the chunkiest paws! What? 
Oh my gosh. That's so cute. I have it pulled up on my laptop so I can't show you guys. Oh my gosh, I'll, I'll show that next stream. That's so nice. Oh my gosh, I wanna show you guys uh, a tattoo that my friend got also. I didn't save it, but I'll show that next time on next stream too. Manga slaps, it's a valid form of literature. I full-heartedly agree. I wish my professors agreed. <laughs> extra beans for extra fun. Or at least it is to me. It is for me too, Rook. It should be in the American educational system. But I suppose it is just not appreciated at this time. Okay, what's left for these little fellows? We've got a wine bottle. We've got some little glasses. I would have so many hours of reading if manga counted. Oh my gosh, same. Miss Spacer, would you like to in my Discord? Ooh, yes. I would. I don't think you can put links in the chat though where it's gonna like kick you. But can I get to it through uh, your channel page? Or you can whisper it to me. Okay, let me let me check it out so I don't I don't forget to do it because we all know I will forget. <laughs> Thank you, Mel. <gasps> Mel, you have sixty nine followers. That's so fun. <laughs> Ooh, okay, I see the link. Bean, can thou send it to Miss Spacer? <laughs> Thank you, guys. I think I found it. Hopefully this is the right one. Oh, it says invite invalid. Okay, never mind. If y'all send it to me, I think I have at least Bean. I think also Rook on Instagram. Some of y'all on Twitter. Uh, any of those ways is excellent. Thank you. Funny number. <laughs> I will send it through IG. Thank you, Beans, and thank you, Mel. Uh, what color are we make in this wine bottle? Is this a fun color? Oh, that's a little too fun. Um, maybe like burgundy wine colored? Ah, I see it in my DMs. Thank you, Beans. This doesn't really look like a bottle. Or maybe, maybe there's hope. Okay, that's like kind of a bottle. Also kind of looks like a jackhammer, but I think that'll work. Maybe we'll make it smoother down here, rounder. And then we gotta give it a little label. This color? Eh. This one... This one's okay. We got the little label. Now we just gotta do the little glasses. This looks so manic. <laughs> oh my gosh. What are we gonna do for the little glasses? Do I have a good color? Maybe this one, actually. This little guy's got a martini glass. with that ice water slaps so hard <laughs> true i actually need to get water at some point in the stream i was really dumb 
and didn't bring any with me. Uh, getting home to do my silly little tasks and look for the silly little painting game. <laughs> we love that. There's also a napkin. Oh my gosh, you're right. Oh. Okay. We have one more glass and then we have cute little napkin. And then I guess they're monocles too. Clown emoji. <laughs> Thank you, Leo. <laughs> I keep telling you guys, that's the first emote we're gonna make when I'm affiliate, is a, is a clown one. I'm really hyped for it. Fancy little boys. They are, aren't they? Alright, what to make the napkin? Maybe just like... this? Should be fine. Right, and then they're monocles. I don't really know what color to do. Maybe this one? The line is so thick. Okay. Thick like a melon <laughs> Damn, they got that 24k gold monocle. <laughs> Is it gold? I was worried for a second that I might have chosen a really putrid green color. Uh, but gold is, is what we want. Let's turn that in. What's your favorite TV show? Ooh, that's a hard one. Hmm. Hmm. If we're talking like... Anime? That might be even harder. <laughs> oh, let's see here. What would my favorite TV show be? I want to be loyal to Naruto, but like, I don't even think I've seen a lot of Naruto. I think I've read it, mostly. I don't know why everything's blanking for me. Cowboy Bebop, the anime, is really good. I remember really vibing with that. How am I, like, forgetting everything I've ever watched in my entire life? Hunter x Hunter was another really good one. Oh, Jujutsu Kaisen too. Those are like some top ones. I don't know if I'd call any of them like my favorite because I don't like them more than another one if that makes sense. If I remember more, I'll give you a better answer, Lillian. <laughs> That's kind of a shitty answer. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> do, you, do you have a favorite TV show? Or anyone. I think we've talked about favorite animes before. I forgot what I said for that when we were talking about it. Probably Jujutsu Kaisen or something similar. I wish I could be at that party too. Bruh, same. Which one are you? I'm the one on the left? Which one's the one on the left? Oh, the manic one. Taste? Fine. Taste in the nicest ice water cats can find. Tell me you watched all of Arcane? No, Leo, it's been like a day. <laughs> I had work today. <laughs> Scooby-Doo. Oh my gosh, that's an excellent choice. Which version of Scooby-Doo? I know there's quite a few. I really like the one that was airing like 10 or something years ago. It had a really nice art style. I don't remember what it was called. All? That's valid. We love all Scooby-Doo's here. The space on the bottom creates movement through the composition. I like the emphasis on dark purple. I have no idea what she means by that. Maybe she means the background? I can see you're a big fan of color. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm probably the one on the right. They look like they were having fun. I can feel that in your painting too. Okay. That's it for now. That one was funny. Your piece will be in the Elevens' Master Gallery. Keep practicing. All right, let's do another one. Surely we're almost done. If we're not done after this one, we might go do some exploring anyway around the overworld. Um, because we've been here for, ooh, an hour? What the heck? Okay. Time really does not feel real. Real? <laughs> real. 
Leo, I promise you I'm gonna watch Arcane this weekend. That's on my number one to-do list for tomorrow. Has anyone else seen Arcane? I keep hearing excellent things about it. For today's assignment, I want you to express love. Think deeply about this one. Love is universal, yet everyone's experience of it is unique. What does love feel like to you? What does it look like? I want you to express that. Bruh, I don't know what to do. Uh, All of it? I will try to watch all of it, Leo. <laughs> I'm not gonna make any promises because I don't want to let you down. <laughs> By the time we stream Sunday night, yes, hopefully. I don't know how many episodes there are or how long it is, so I can't make any promises, but if it's just like something like 12, I don't know. Uh, not yet, but the animation and art style is chef's kiss. Yes, it looks so good. The hell is love? Honestly, Lillian, I'm wondering the same thing. I have no idea what to do for this prompt. Nine episodes each, or nine episodes, 40 minutes each. Okay. Okay. I think we can try for that in two days. How long did it take you to watch it? One day? I, th I can see that taking me two days. Might take me three. So I might not be fully done with it by the weekend, but I will certainly try. Bro, what am I gonna do for love? Uh, oh my gosh, let's draw Elliot from Stardew Valley. I love him. I was watching it while it was airing. Oh, I forgot that it was like airing. I always assume that things just like come out now in it's their entirety. Right, let's see if I can draw Elliot with this horrible mouse. And let's see how long I can try and draw him without a reference. Uh, then I rewatched it with my ex and we watched three episodes a day. Oh wait, no, I skipped something. I watched three episodes at a time and then I rewatched it with my ex and we watched three episodes a day too. Three episodes a day? How long would that be? Like 120 minutes? I see. Okay, okay. Nora Hart. <laughs> Why is the fill tool in this game actually good? For real? Yeah, the, the brushes in this game are so fun. Actually, here, I gotta show you guys this one. I'll get rid of it because it won't make any sense to use. But look at this brush. Isn't it the best thing you've ever seen? I love it. It brings me so much joy. And you can actually customize this color palette that it shows you. It's super fun. So pretty, I like the colors. It's so cool. This game has so many cool like customization things. Actually, I don't know if I can... Yeah, okay. You can make your own hat in this game. And I made a, a Naruto headband for our character here. <laughs> so now my character looks exactly as I did from ages, what, like 13 and up? It's so cute. I, I love this game so much. Now I gotta find orange for his hair. Do I have an orange? Is this orange? Okay, I was gonna try to do this without a reference, but I think I need a reference for Elliot. Let me do a quick Google. Um, Elliot Stardew. Yeah, this orange isn't too far off. It's got such nice hair. I bet I'm gonna goof it up. We'll clean that up a bit. Yes, that's orange, tea god. <laughs> Thank you, beans. Where's red? 
Hopefully this is red. I'll give him a neck, actually. That's that's important. This is looking a little gooberish. Actually, let's do his neck first. I don't know why I thought doing the clothes first would be a good idea. How did you do shading in this game? I forgot I had an essay to write. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, Lillian. Godspeed. <laughs> I hope it's not a hard one and one that you can crank out in like 30 minutes. That is not a fun feeling. Is this really gonna look like Elliot or is it just gonna look like a redhead at the end of the day? I don't know yet. Probably the latter. Does he have darker eyebrows in his hair? Kind of looks like that. What color is this? Is this brown? It's brown now. That's some thick eyebrows. Yeah, boy. Um. Do they give them eye colors? Kind of just looks also brown. Let's do this. There we go. Lovely. <laughs> kind of gooberish. Got, got to do what you got to do. Okay, I can live with that. Um. Okay, let's give him his shirt now. Just gotta do the hair, and then maybe give a background color, and then I think we're good to go. Finally drawing Elliot fan art. I was gonna say on stream, but I don't think I've drawn any yet. Quite disappointing. Kind of looks like Ponyo, but like an adult. I gotta write about Christmas. If I don't finish by Monday, I am screwed. Oh no, that's a weird essay prompt, but at least you've got the weekend. It's not even Christmas yet. Leo, it's basically here. It's only in like uh, two weeks, right? Oh, that is not orange. That's a really strange essay prompt though. What class is that for? <laughs> shading in his hair? I don't know if I can. I don't think I have another orange color. Oh, I guess I have like a red. Or maybe it's a pink. It's a pink, isn't it? Yeah, I don't think- I don't think I want to give him pink highlights. Maybe red highlights? Nah. I think that's good enough. Okay. Homeroom? Oh, that's strange. I don't remember getting homework when I had homeroom. That's so weird. Well, Lillian, you have our emotional support. We're here for you. Let's 
let's make his hair a little more majestic and then we'll pick that background color and then we will be done. Why do I keep doing that? There we go. Okay. Maybe we'll just do blue. Actually, I have a really nice blue save, don't I? Oh, is this purple? looks like adult Ponyo. I really can't unsee that. I wasn't able to give him his, like, manly feature, his, his chiseled charm. Don't know what to write. I am screwed. Ah, I, I don't know what I would write about either. An essay on Christmas is really weird. That's a really good emote, though, Leo. <laughs> that really captures the mood. <laughs> Alright, let's see how our art critique goes. Maybe something in this game will bring inspiration, <laughs> although I don't think there's any talk of Christmas in this. That's really beautiful, Eggs. Elliot is quite beautiful, isn't he? <laughs> Feels right to me. Your sparing use of dark brown is pleasing, okay? Uh, you really put that blue to work. Ooh, the background, nice. It's equally light and dark. Ooh. Hmm. You know, I've never really been in love. <laughs> oh, getting right to it. But I'd like to feel like this someday. Oh, that's sweet. Okay, that's all for now. Your piece will be in dinner's eggs. Keep practicing. Okay, let me check if I can see how many uh, art classes we have left. <gasps> we have one more art class. Oh my gosh, okay. Wait, then we'll just do it here, and then we'll go explore. I didn't realize we were almost done. I thought we had like four more. Let's go. This is the last one. Take your places, everyone. Yay. All right, what's it gonna be? Probably another art restoration? This is it, everyone. The final lesson. Of course, I've saved the most intricate piece for last. This classic will challenge your every artistic skill. We'll be doing a master study of... Bruh. John Kirsten from Attack on Titan. Portrait of a Horse Looking Back by Korn. Striking, isn't it? Put all your heart into it and see what you can make. Okay, let me pull up a John Kirsten photo for reference. Is that joke still relevant? I haven't made that joke since I was in, like, high school. <laughs> I love horses. Horses are very nice. I used to live next to a horse, and now I don't anymore, and it's quite sad. I think about him quite often. Anyone have a pet horse? Well, I was going to try to draw John from Attack on Titan as a joke, but I don't think I have enough colors for that, so let's just do the horsey. But what color to make the horse? This seems like a maybe a good horse color. I think I can live with that. I feel like I'm already botching this one. Now is not easy to do. Ears. This is looking quite scary right now. I, I promise I'm gonna try to make this look better. We've 
got our base. to pick from. We got a weird palette for this one. Some hair. It's not like the John from Attack on Titan haircut. Okay, he's got a little diamond. Pop. I think we're gonna get a meme out of this. <laughs> That's to be expected. It's my stream, of course. Can't have a, a sissy spacer stream without some kind of meme developing. <laughs> that looks like an anime eye or an alien eye. It should have a big smile. That sounds scary. <laughs> I'll try to do that. Uh, let's do the nose and then we'll try giving it some kind of mouth. Oh, oh no. I feel like this is gonna look creepy. Like, that looks weird. <laughs> I got the intro done. Yes, Lillian! Right on! Ooh, that sounded like a pun. Uh, that was pretty fast. That's quite the efficient use of time. I think you'll get it done in no time then. Intro is one of the hardest parts because that's where you figure out what the heck you're writing about. <laughs> What if I gave it a tiny smile? That might look cuter. I feel like when I give it a smile, it makes this look like an elephant trunk. It is not... Oh, maybe like that? Does that kind of look like a smile? I can't tell. I'll, I'll leave that in. Hopefully that appeases the desire to have it smiling. Uh, let's give it a background. I don't know what color to do. It's green. It's in some nice green pastures. Oh, I didn't want to do that. But I do want to give it some kind of shading. It looks like there's like bushes in the back. We'll just do a lazy little- ah! Not that lazy. Lazy little rush with the brush. Okay. Alright. I think I can live with that. A horse. Kind of smiling. Little smile. Alright, rushes down. Let's see how we did. Once. <laughs> I would uh, certainly agree with that. If I was titling this piece, that would be it. <laughs> Chills. <laughs> this one always freaks me out. What? <laughs> you really put that orange to work. I can't help but notice the splash of dark red. I appreciate your varied colored choices here. All right, your piece will be in the Elevens' Master Gallery eggs. And that's it. You've completed every art class we have to offer. Oh my gosh, congratulations. Please take this honorary degree. You got an art degree. Your studies may be done here, but you should never ever stop practicing. Your artistic journey never ends. Oh, that was so sweet. And we got the achievement graduate. Let's talk to our, this is our sister, Clementine. Still coming for more classes, huh? Guess you're really taking the wielder thing seriously. I'm glad for you. 
You don't even have to graduate or anything, but I guess it's good to practice too. All right, are there more classes? Well done, Eggs. You are unquestionably a master of art now, but there's always room to continue improving. I hope you'll take your newfound skills across picnic. Oh, there's not. Uh, did we ever go back here? Yes, but we didn't color it in. Uh, let's give it some color real quick. I don't know what I was doing on the walls here, but sure, <laughs> we'll leave that. We'll respect the classics. All right, let's yeet out of here. We walk really fast. I do not remember that. Uh, another lovely thing about this game is that um, it was like all in black and white. So all the color here, as you can probably tell, we added that. So it's like a giant coloring book. And it was a lot of fun to fill in. This emote reminds me of Treasure Planet. Oh my god, yeah, it looks like more. Wait, that's so cute. <laughs> Wanna get a lift somewhere? Actually, I don't know. Do we wanna get a lift? I don't know where I should go. Um, hmm, it's been an hour 30. What all do I need to look for? We've got... Oh, what are we missing? We're missing one brush style. We're missing some decor pieces, some litter, and some clothing items. I think if we go to luncheon, we can maybe find some of those things, because there are some shops. Dang, we're cruising. Ooh, I don't think this is where the spores are, though. Uh, down here? Here's something. Cafe? Cola. Hey, mate. Wanna update your shirt design? Uh, nah. I like it. Oh, hello. Brussels sprout? Oh, wow. This is kind of embarrassing. I came out here to study your work. I didn't think I'd run into you here. Um, I'm not sure what to say. It's really nice. Thanks for, uh, coloring everything. Bro, we just did a bunch of art classes together. Don't be nervous. Uh, I don't think I want to go that way. Down here? Hello? It's beans! Beans? <laughs> you know, I never pictured life taking this road. But I guess sweet things can happen when you least expect it. I'm so glad Pepper's gonna stay for the long haul. Makes me feel more than ready to take care of all these kids. Um, plus, she just makes me happy. Oh, Beans, this character shares your name. <laughs> and they have all these kids together. I don't know all of their names. Maybe one of them is Beans Jr. Any more stores? I suppose not. I thought there might have been... Clothing store. Oh, wait a minute. Um, hmm. I guess we'll just world- oh, never mind. I was gonna say we'll world travel, but, uh, I don't trust myself to not get lost. Go check out another town. Let's see, a lot of our art is in Elevens's, so maybe let's go to Elevens's and we can look at the the art gallery there. I think it's down here. In here, perhaps? Yes! Okay. This is all the art we did for the game. I actually forgot about a lot of these pieces. Um, Pistachio is very creepy. This is the only game character I do not like. He's literally like... A stalker. He broke into my house. Marzipan, on the other hand, is lovely. Whoa! You got classic painting? Oh, I forget. 
we get all the paintings that we restored. I think lasagna is really getting at something here. We talk and act like civilized folks, but deep down, we're all just chaotic storms of emotion, aren't we? I mean, it's not just me, right? Okay, this is us recreating that same piece. Uh, clearly, <laughs> the other one <laughs> was better. <laughs> I don't know how to sugarcoat that. We gave it an honest effort, though. It's not much, but it's honest work. Um, I think my favorite ones... This is one of them, for sure. I had a lot of fun doing this one. I'm saying no to downloading these gifts, but I'll save them on my own. And then hopefully post them on Instagram or something. This is another fun one. I really liked how this one turned out because we used the fun brush, baby. Uh, the horse actually looks quite nice. I must say, I really like that. Uh, the breezy field one turned out nice too. The manic cats is very fun, <laughs> but I don't think it's my best work. <laughs> I wonder if these are count as decor pieces. Hopefully they do. Cooking Cozy by Manicoti. This piece is over a century old, but it depicts something timeless. That cook's warm, inviting in expression, and the way the ingredients loom in the foreground. It feels like a warm, cozy fortress, and it gives you a window into the everyday life of yesteryear. Makes me want a hot bowl of cozy for myself. Uh, this was our recreation of that one. I feel like we didn't make the doggo as chonky as the original, but again, we tried our best. <laughs> Gave it an honest effort. It's not much, but it's honest work. This was a fun one, though. I liked this. This one. I forgot this was a restoration piece. So lovely. The original is so cute. I got my first paragraph done. Lillian, you're cruising! Fluffy, fluffy sheep. This was one of our newest additions to the gallery. Coco first came to Picnic from a faraway place, but she had a big influence on Picnic's art history. There's such a warmth and kindness to her art, isn't there? It makes you think the artist must have a kind heart, too. Yes, I love that piece. It's probably one of my favorite in the game. This one? Oh my gosh, this was the wizard one. I didn't even remember what it looked like. I really took some artistic liberties <laughs> with the one we did. Mine kind of just looks like a bear, it doesn't even look like a dog. The Wizard by Falafel. This piece is old, but not that old. Falafel dressed and posed his figure to evoke the medieval era. It all adds to make quite a charming piece, no? Yes, quite charming indeed. Classic painting. Uh, this one we made into Majora's Mask, which I don't think turned out great, but it was fun. Letting Go by Fries. It's a historical piece about the lasting impact of the Brush Wars. It's a really dark piece, tonally and visually. The only source of light are spirits of the knight's fallen comrades. It works visually, but it's also kind of a nice metaphor, isn't it? They're finally letting go of those they lost, and it gives them some warmth. Let's hope there's never another brush war. Yes. We got... A breezy field! Okay, these are the ones we just saw. You can really feel the breeze in this one, can't you? Yeah, this one's really lovely. This one and the sheep one, I think, are my favorites. The pose, the dramatic landscape. This one is a mood. Uh, it's strongly from the anime period of art history. <laughs> Wait, what? Let's go! I thought that might have been like Mount Fuji in the background, but I didn't want to say it because I didn't want to sound like a weeb. I love all the artists in this gallery, but Vanilla might be my favorite. In an era overflowing with wonderful art, her stood out. I'd give anything to see what her original colors were like. Pepe, I can't say we did that one justice. This one is very fun. 
I am chugging water. Bruh, I need to chug water. I might do that after this section, actually. Embrace the weebness. <laughs> I guess I guess I have to now. I've come out. Uh, Majora's Mask. I'll, I'll go back up and show you guys that piece, but I think it looks kind of wonky. Majora's Mask is so lit, though. Uh, the Bachelor Party by Plantain. Plantain's really interesting, a really interesting character historically. They say that later in life he suffered greatly. From violent mood swings and mental illness, his art also got a lot more experimental and interesting. Some psychologi psychologists actually studied how his art changed over his life. As a window into his shifting mental state. But the more they scrutinized it, the less it explained anything to do with his mental health. It goes to show how stigmatized mental illness is. Any old artist can draw weird stuff and it's fine, but if that artist is suffering from mental illness, their experimentation is evidence of their madness. Kind of a double standard, right? Pop off, Marzipan. Folks see romance in the idea of a mad artist, but struggling with mental health doesn't help anyone make anything. If anything, it's amazing that Plantain could still paint so late in his life. I like to think painting gave him some peace and balance. His characters still make me smile anyway. That got intense. Ah, and last but not least. Portrait of a horse looking back by Korn. It's the very last missing piece. Amazing job. There's just so much to unpack about it. The figure is nude, but the focus is solely on their expression. <laughs> Despite that, you can feel them laid bare before you. That coquettish look over the shoulder. I don't think I've heard that word before. And looking back has a double meaning, doesn't it? They seem to be looking back at us, but what else lies behind them? It all adds to the timeless mystery of their expression. But of course, the most salient detail. The hyperrealism. It's a lot to take in, isn't it? It's almost realer than real, good one devs. <laughs> that has to be a photo, right? It gives me the heebie-jeebies. That's how you know Korn was a real master. Alright, Mars and Now that anyone can make a brush, I bet the art world is going to explode. What new kinds of classics are possible now? It'll probably be great. And probably also a bit terrible. <laughs> like the internet. <laughs> Pop off, Marzipan! That's pretty funny. Uh, this is the Majora's Mask one. This one took a while, and then I, I just kind of gave up towards the end. I thought it fit well with the, like, fairies being the, like, spirits. Pog, thank you, Mel. Is that your favorite Zelda game, Mel, or just one of the faves? I think that's one of my faves. I guess it's hard to pick a favorite Zelda game. Hard to pick any favorite game, period. Alright, we're not talking to Pistachio, because Pistachio creeps me out. Let's give this place some color, though. Can't really have an art gallery and not have color. There we go. Oh, the stairs. There we go. Alright. Uh, mine was Ocarina of Time. I think that's mine too. I think now it's like Ocarina of Time for nostalgia, but in terms of my favorite game to play, I think it's Breath of the Wild. I felt too anxious with the time limit for Majora's. Bruh, not only did that make me anxious, I just never was able to beat the game. <laughs> I was so bad. <laughs> Uh, but it still, like, created, like, really good memories for me playing it. I thought it was so cool, like, it was one of the, like, scariest games I'd ever played at the time. Hello? Ginger? Oh, hello, eggs! I was curious about what style you were using to color here. Uh, honestly, same. This seems like a fairly balanced approach. Not overly simple or decorative. I'm sure people will love this. I always like more details, but it's not really my place to say. 
Thanks for your hard work. Uh, thank you. Let's travel again. Try and find all of our art pieces, and then we might call it. Uh, I think Summer Springs is where some of our art is. Is it inside the resort? <gasps> yes! The beast! Bruh. That's pretty cool for like... I forget if this is a hotel or an apartment. I didn't add much color here. I didn't want to do that. Okay. Um... I want to color her in. Oh no. There we go. Yay. Very nice. I don't think we need to go up. Am done. Dang, Lillian. Pop off. You crushed that very fast. Very proud. Claps in chat. Frog detective. So, what are you up to? I actually solved a mystery involving missing furniture. Oh. Wow. I'll be honest, that sounds really fun. I'm trying really hard now to think to not think about that mystery. I'm working on creating clear personal boundaries to improve my work-life balance. Bruh, this is <laughs> this is hitting close to home. <laughs> yeah, I hear that. <laughs> For real, my guy. Uh, let's give this place some more color too. Where else should we go? Oh. Keep misclicking. Alright, um, I don't think there are any stores in this area, but just in case. Oh. Okay. Somehow, we're missing a brush. Oh, maybe if we call home, we'll get a hint. Hello? Hi, Mom. Ah, eggs. Your sister was just here. How are you doing? You explain your whole situation to Mom. Hmm, I see. Well, it sounds like, for starters, it looks like you beat the entire game. <laughs> but there's still plenty for you to do. You should find a place for Chicory to move to. Oh, I forgot about that. The flag she gave you would be in your decor menu. Put it outside somewhere she might like to live. At least, that's what I think. It was sweet of you to call Iggs. Remember, your mom loves you very much. Oh my gosh, let's let's have Chicory move in next to us. Let's go, baby. Uh, back to luncheon. I forgot about that. Thank you, mother. Oh, this is another one of our... Paintings. This one was a fun one too. I, I think I like how this one turned out. Although the hair gives me like slight caveman vibes. I guess I cleaned it up. Okay. Okay. I like this one. I do want to save the gift, just not now. Wow, wow, this piece is so personal. Looking at this, I really feel like I'm getting to know you. You seem like such an interesting person. I wish I was interesting too. Peppermint, you are interesting. Okay, let's get... 
Oh, that's not what I want to do. Let's get this decor out. Chicory flag. Uh, right here. Yay. Now what? This is where Chicory's house could go. Better go back to the wielder tower and let her know. Ooh, everyone. Let's look at my house. What? Oh, it's our dad. <laughs> I was like, who's in here? Hey, eggs. Why is he, like, standing on our bed? Thought I'd come for a little visit. I guess that's classic dad energy. Some dad and kid time, right? I've been keeping busy with the holy shop. But you've been keeping busy with the wielding, too. Heh, <laughs> we're both just old busybodies. Still, you should take it easy sometime. I probably worked too hard when you were little. Sometimes I'm worried I missed your childhood. Don't miss out on life, eggs. You'll be old and full of regrets before you know it. Aww. Aww. Our parents are so cute. Our family's so cute, actually. Uh, let's go to the wielding tower. I quit walking into things. And find Chicory. Oh my gosh, wait. That's our wielder portrait, self-portrait. This was like, I think my all-time favorite prompt part of the game. This was so fun and cute. Made me so happy. I forgot this was here. Fun times. I think this one I do have posted on Instagram. Chicory. Oh, you picked out where my new place should be? So you think I should live in luncheon? Well, yeah. Sounds good to me. Well, being anywhere else sounds good right now. I'm excited to see the spot you picked. Heh <laughs> heh I'll head there straight away and set up. Come visit me sometime. Oh, I will. Little does she know. It's literally next to my house. And we're about to be neighbors. It's already built. Whoa, look at this coloring. This is so nice. Looks like we're neighbors now. <gasps> and she acknowledges it. That's so cute. It's definitely not the same as living in a tower, but I think it suits me better. Feels good to finally be somewhere new. I think this could be a fresh start for me. Oh. Okay, this is something we drew for Chicory. <laughs> Not my best work. <laughs> but it was early in the game. Still a classic. We're gonna have to put serious thought into how we teach people to grow brushes. In the moment, it seemed to make so much sense. But how do you teach that to someone? Maybe we'll have to lend our brushes around. I'm excited to use my own new brush for some more. You like how I did my place up? Yes! But I haven't done much else since that final battle. Feels strange since you've already got colors everywhere. Oh my gosh, she has little sparklies in her colors too. Almost don't want to mess with it, you know? Oh my gosh, no, please mess with it. Please add some sparklies. I've got a lot of work to do, especially on myself. I really want to be better, but I think what I need is to accept myself when I'm not. Oh, That's... I still don't really know how to do that, but I'm gonna try. Well, I'm sure I'll be seeing a lot of you. It's scary to step into a new multi-brush world, but I feel like with you I can do it. That's corny, isn't it? No, that's so cute, but I mean it. When this all started, just getting out of bed felt impossible to me. But we've done a lot of impossible things together. So impossible doesn't mean much to me anymore. Thanks for being there when I needed you. Oh, Can they hug, please? No. Okay. Uh, I am back after dying for like 30 minutes. Welcome back, Beans. I'm gonna leave <laughs> and get water. <laughs> I'll be right back, I promise. I'm gonna sprint. Uh, please enjoy the view of Chicory's beautiful house. I'll be like 10 seconds.